it's me, it's Johnny Boy, we're back in the garden, and today, as per usual, like we've been doing for some time, we're using the Ruby DX250 1400, okay? I promised I would be doing a review on this very, very soon. I will be doing a review, and I'm going to go through every component. But in the meantime, generally, as a machine, absolutely spot on, absolutely perfect. We're going to go through, there are a couple of things that I think that can be improved. Who am I? I'm not an engineer. These are just observations. But the most important thing that I need to point out to you guys, if you come here now and just have a look from here, if you look at that now, if you close up on that now and have a look, That is a ceramic blade. It's not for porcelain, okay? But I can assure you, I wanted to test that blade to see how it would cut other materials. I've cut blocks, I've cut slabs, concrete slabs, I've cut block paving. I've cut endless and endless of porcelain, and I've actually cut slate. And I can honestly say, if you look around, if you just span around this job, this job is all about cuts. It's all about making the project a little bit more complicated and it looks as if somebody's made a massive effort and because of that we've had to do cut after cut after cut we've cut slate we've cut porcelain we've cut everything and when you start cutting squares you're cutting a lot more if you look on here all the way through we're cutting both sides okay we're marking and then we're cutting again to create the shape that little ceramic blade has done metres and metres of cuts. I have never known a blade in 38 years to cut as much as that blade, okay? Even as a ceramic blade, it's been absolutely excellent and it's absolutely spot on. And I will be putting this on YouTube, okay? I'm going to do this as a separate video so you can have a look at it because people have asked me and thank you very much for all your kind comments and all your likes lately. It's absolutely brilliant. Um, if you come round, you can have a look. Let's just familiarise ourselves with this machine. Okay, it's called the DX250-1400, okay? And one of the things guys will say to you is that because the porcelain is trending at the moment and porcelain planks, the, the, the oblong at the shape, they're going to say, well, how big can you get on there? Well, that's 1400, and that's what I suggest that if you look at it, it's actually 1 metre 850, but without a doubt, you could get on there a 1.5 meter plank a 1.5 and a little bit more okay but it's been absolutely a wonderful machine uh, i've been so lucky so fortunate to come across this and as i've said before on many occasions that these machines are game changer an absolute game changer on many levels bending over your back you're able to stand up you're able to mark you're able to have that now we have got a table on the side, we can extend out this way, okay, but more importantly, it keeps the dust down and it saves it going on your lungs. Remember, PPE is so important. Now this is going to form part of a bigger vlog, which I'm going to be talking about very soon. So, any of you guys want to know a little bit more, and girls want to know a little bit more information about these machines, I'm going to do a more thorough review, more spec, whether it's a 110, 240, what the motor size is, okay, what the heights, the lengths, and how you, you erect and put it together. In the meantime, if you need any other advice, just drop us an email at info at greentoplandscapes.co.uk or go to the website, which is www.greentoplandscapes.co.uk. The other uh, thing I want to bring you is that if you do need any information, we are speaking to Ruby on a regular basis. They are a company that aren't worried about any other company. There are lots of other saws out there that are good. There are saws that are not so good. There are blades that are good and some blades that are not so good. But for me, in my opinion, using this, it's been absolutely excellent. Thank you, Ruby.